Look, you can all shop for whatever you want, but my Veep and I have our own list. You want me to be vice president? You'll make me look good and help me carry the kid vote. Kids can't vote. Are you seriously engaging with them on this? Well, you know what I mean, the younger crowd. You know you need to be 35 to be vice president. Well, you need to shut up to remain unpunched. How's that? I'm easily 35 in zombie land years. Okay, I'm in. Let's little rock the boat. <laughs> That's moderately catchy. Now let's get some snacks. So, what exactly are we shopping for? The usual. Beer and canned salsas. As many Twinkies as I can find. Oh, and those chocodiles. And markers and poster board for campaign signs. I suppose it is nice to see them taking an interest in politics. doing this or what I'm trying but it's not working let's try something else
time to nut up or shut up. Let's little rock the boat. Being honest here, that's getting a bit much. Are you even trying? Let's see what we're working with. Oh, shit! This gigantic fat bastard from some backwater nowhere needs a few extra rounds pumped into his morbidly obese belly.
8800. These guys just keep on taking hits. They were sent from the zombie apocalypse to feed. Oh, mother. around to hear you. Yeah, Utah's just bad. Utah had one of the highest literacy rates in the nation. That's what you've got for Utah? That's your big counterpoint? People could read? They also had zombies that could take a hell of a beating. True. Let's grab these Twinkies and hit the campaign trail and leave these T-800s in our dust. I'd like to thank my guns and my mop, both for giving me what I needed to be the finely tuned, handsome killing machine you see before you. I'm nutted up, no need to shuttle up. <laughs> 